Welcome to BASP GIS tutorial. In today's lecture, I will show you how to calculate normalize difference buildup index. So, normalize difference buildup index describe the buildup density of any geographic area, which is calculated as a ratio between a short wave infrared and near infrared and have indices range from minus 1 to plus 1. Formula for NDBI normalized difference buildup index which is short wave infrared minus near infrared divided by short wave infrared plus near infrared. So for land set 8 image band 6 is used for short wave infrared and band 5 is used for near infrared and for land set 7 band 5 is used for short wave infrared and band 4 is used for near infrared so I will show you how to calculate the normalized difference buildup index on Landsat 8 image. So open the software. Here go to data and add the Landsat 8 image. Here you can see that we will add band 6 and band 5 of Landsat 8 satellite. So add the band 6 and band 5. Now we add these two images to the software. Then go to data management tool, go to special analysis tool, here go to map algebra tool and click on raster calculator and type this formula in raster calculator. Here we will put the formula. See that band 6 minus band 5 and band 6 plus band 5. This is the band 6 minus band 5 divided by band 6 plus band 5 now if you want to change the name to the output raster layer here you can change it N D B I normalized difference buildup index. You can choose a location where you want to save the raster layer. Then go to this option. It will connect you with the folder where you want to save your raster layer. So click on OK. The process is going on. Wait for that.
here you can see that the NDVI is calculated I tell you it is the ratio between the short wave infrared and near infrared which range from minus 1 to plus 1 here you can see that so uncheck this band this is the normalized difference and belt appendix if you want to classify it then go to properties and go to symbology here you click on classified and select the color click on apply change the color By this way, you can calculate the normalized difference and build up index. You can choose a different color for that. I just show you that how to calculate NDBI NGS software. So, I hope you will learn that how to calculate normalized difference build up index. Thank you.